So who's the actual boss here, then? Is it Michelle, Steve or Liz? Mm. Well, they all like to think they are, and when you ask a question, you get three different answers. Oh, well, I'm sure Tyra will have this place running like clockwork in no time. Well, they all seem pretty laid back, though. Yeah, especially Steve. He did a shift the other day in his pyjama bottoms, because he says we're like newsreaders and it doesn't matter what you wear on the bottom half. <laughs> so, uh, Simon tells me you two are organising Leanne's baby shower. Yeah, we are. Very different ideas, though. Yeah, all I'm saying is, I don't think the shower should be like, you know, girly girly. Oh, sorry. What do you think? We should have a booking bronco and a bucket of beer. Well, what do you think, Peter? Because, I mean, you know her as well as any of us. Not my monkey, not my circus. Eh? Hey? Calling Leanna monkey. <laughs> no, it's an old saying. Means I am keeping out of it. You both love Leanne, don't you? Of course. Helps. Well, I think you should be doing what makes her happy and not going at each other like cats in a sack. Maybe she's right. Yeah, we are already on a warning. Do you want to um, do one of them truce thingies? Yeah, let's do a truce. Look, I better get going, because I promised I'd cook tea tonight. Bye. Yeah, uh, let's chat about the party arrangements later, yeah? I'll uh, call you. Yeah, I can't wait. <clears throat> so, are you two going to play nice now? Yeah, could you see that? She's always got to have the last picking word. So, we can bring our own music. When Jenny told me you proposed, you could have knocked me down with a feather. <laughs> me and all. <laughs> me and all. Yeah, me and all. Well, I have to say, little Gemma played her part in knocking some sense into me. How come? I was playing putrid. Cupid. Cupid. She was right the first time. I think it's romantic. Love blooming amongst the knickerbins. I'll just say this. You mess her about, and you'll have me to answer to. Well, I know I've messed about Didn't a bit. Ask for an explanation. But... I'm just saying. She's got your card marked. And I think it's great to get a bit of good news for a change, eh? Never mind what anyone else says. What do you mean? What anyone else says? Shall I organise some nibbles, Mr. Connor? That'd be lovely, Sal. Thanks. I'll help. <laughs> I'm just nipping to the loo. Mm. He dumped her, and now he's marrying her. Been in a coma or something, and nobody's had the heart to tell me. Um, Aidan, listen, I, I know this must have come as a shock to you. I mean, it did to me as well. But I, I love your dad, and I'd like to think that we could bury the hatchet, and especially now we're going to be family. Fair enough. I'm pleased for you both. <laughs> I know what we're from.